hello amazing people to all the fans of love is blind today we are back again with another video of uh, jessica and mark it's their wedding day so the big question here is are they gonna go through with it to the altar and say yes to each other are they gonna prove to us that love is blind i don't know let's stick around and see what goes on as for me from the start i would say that jessica did not put mark first and uh, we know that she was emotionally involved with Burnett. And when Burnett turned her down, that is when she gave Mark a chance. I can put it like that. So I would think she has been not been straight with her emotions from the beginning. And that's why they've had problems even connecting. They did not connect like other couples did connect. You could see that so clearly. And that's the reason as to why even Mark prepared this particular dinner. If you remember this in episode 9 with a wall uh, between them so that they can try and trace their feelings, their emotions on how they connected in the pods. So as for me, whatever comes, I will accept. It. But I know Jessica, Jessica is going to disappoint Mark. Tell me what you think in the comment section before we reach to the time they say yes in the altar. Do you think Jessica is going to go through? with this i don't think so as for mark he has been there for jessica even though they had a very huge difference age difference mark did not care about that all he cared about was to make jessica happy to be with her and to marry her yes, before you know having mark by my side who's such an amazing incredible person he's changed me for the better and that is why you marry someone is this the most genuine reason as to why people get married because someone has changed you really not even because of love jessica i smell a rat here i do smell one and the first time i heard jessica's voice i knew that she was one and honestly to have that kind of emotional connection with someone without ever even seeing them is the, the most amazing thing that's ever happened Mark is so sure about what he's feeling he's so sure about what he wants and I don't think he has any doubts. I think he's going to go through with this. He's going to say yes. And let's just see what Jessica has for us. I am decided if love is blind. Mark Anthony Cuevas, do you take Jessica Nicole Batten to be your lawful wedded wife to live? Is it a yes or a no from Mark? As for me, I think Mark is going to say yes. The only person I have doubts with is Jessica. he said yes he said yes now let's wait for jessica's turn it's jessica's turn let's see if she's gonna let us down now jessica nicole batten do you take mark anthony cuevas to be your lawful wedded husband jessica is such a pretender she's been waiting all this time to walk to the altar so that she can disappoint mark because that was such a disappointment even when mark took some time to answer the i do questions she was looking at him like seriously are you gonna let me down and it's a time now and she's taking like forever to say i do or no what's up jesse you're such a disappointment i'm so disappointed She just waited to come to this fire to say, I cannot. Yeah, she just said not to Mark. It's so painful. And she kept on complaining from the first time about his age, about everything. I didn't even see anyone walk her down the aisle. This is something that she knew it was not going through. But hey, we have enjoyed the show Love is Blind. Give this video a thumbs up. The show was amazing, even though Kenny and uh, Kelly also did not make it. Yes, they made it to the altar, but the wedding did not go through. But we enjoyed the show. We did enjoy the show to this far. My congratulations to Cameron and Lauren and Amber and Burnett. They're the only ones who made it to the last minute and they said yes to each other. They did not disappoint each other. I wish you a happy marriage life. If you've come to this far, please subscribe if you haven't. Until next time, bye.